Hello and welcome back to War World. By the way, I think it was yeah in the first episode I mentioned that when I started the game it showed this and it kind of skipped the first one because I had to press the start recording button. There you go. <laughs> My grandpa once said the wall has an edge and people used to live at the bottom of it on the ground. He said the earth was round. Sounds crazy, but uh, how can one live on a ball, and how would he know the supposed bottom of and was it? How would he know about the supposed bottom of it? We've been living on the wall for several generations at least, and so far no one has e has found even a hint of a top or bottom. So there you go. So it kind of goes over one we missed there but let's get started where we left off now we've not quite got enough for that vacuum cleaner unfortunately but we can get to plane I think at the end of this we'll have enough for the vacuum cleaner and we'll have enough for one of the dodge buttons at least Right, let's go. Right, there's the back. Okay, let's see, we are nearly there with the first wave coming in. Can we get some upgrades before that happens? Right, looks like we will be getting a uh, the upgrades in before the first wave. What do we have? Absolutely we can go for that. Any second now, here comes the wave. And we're away. Okay. So it looks like we found a fair bit down here. We'll kind of clear the perimeter out. And then we'll grab all we can and go. Ooh, we are finding a lot down here. It just keeps going. <laughs> so we've got a very large first mine, it looks like. Right, we'd best get back. Right, away we go. We're going to need that mining efficiency and the uh, speed upgrades, I think, now. What have we got? A turret replicator. We've seen that before, though we didn't really get a chance to use it. Let's get that bought. Right, 
not gun him. We'll leave ones near the beginning. Yeah, we'll leave these ones because we can kind of easily come back for those if need be. Um, okay, we are carving through this a lot faster. Found a dead end here. And is this the end here? Looks like it is. No, it's not quite. There we go. The actual end to it. Found the shotgun. Hey. Okay, let's get all this uh, sucked up. Luckily we've got a very good carrying capacity nowadays. We'll slice through here. Uh-oh. That's my bad, I wasn't looking that much. We are going to lose a lot of health because of this, aren't we? Yeah, most likely we... Oh yeah, we are. Get rid of those. Spawns them, and there we go. Now we just need to clean up the remainder of these. And that should be everything from this mine, then. Oh, am I not quite have enough room? Damn. Let's see if we can at least drag them along with us to the front. Close enough, right. Go. Cool. And next mine. While well, I'm at it. Definitely got a bit of stick drift. Definitely got a bit of stick drift in your pad. Right, down we go. We've spent seven minutes in that first mine. Okay. Let's see. How would you hear that? <laughs> ah, it's one of these rooms. Yes, the hermit has already lost. Uh, the hermit was already lost when most of us were uh, wet behind the ears. Uh, uh, the hermit was already old when most of us were wet behind the ears. But is this proof of his divine nature? Maybe he has simply kept his son hidden, and now that son plays his part. Right. Get these got. Get him. Get him. Got him. Complete. Next mine. Uh, 
Right. Oh, it's a slightly more difficult one. Grounding hole will be a little bit harder to break. But we'll see if we can't get in there and get some stuff. Usually this green turf means that yeah, there's going to be a lot of these green crystals in here, typically. Till the next wave. Right, well, let's get out. Okay. is on about half health so they'll want to watch out for that. But we are going to have plenty of green crystals for healing at this point. I think we might want to get that. We'll repair a little. I think it's finally time to get some uh, weapon upgrades. That should work. Oh, and don't forget we've got a shotgun. stuff. Right, that's the end of it. We can move on to the next mine. We've got seven and a half minutes to go. 
Let's see what we can get before the big bad shows up. Good news is, looking at the top, we've got over 6,000 uh, meta points in there. So, we'll definitely be able to buy a few upgrades after this. That's for certain. Shots deal 20% more damage. Hmm. Is that just with everything? Or is it with like a specific weapon I don't know? Okay, and we're already... It's already go time. Go, go, go. manageable when you've got uh, a few weapon upgrades, definitely not. Right, a small mine, which we've now depleted. Let's go. Cloud layer. Right. Now we have to go all the way back up. So that's going to be unfortunate. Right. Yep. All the way up. Past the mines that we're picking through. might be a good idea is to uh, once we get there maybe even put down some of those turrets that we've got it might help us get past this uh, boss wave right we'll get these This looks like it's the last mine in the area as well. <coughs> there's another cloud layer up there. Right. Now, can I build any more? No, apparently not. Okay. So there's a fair bit of stuff up here, so that's good news. Looks like I've got another schematic. Fire it and pellets in each shot. Excellent stuff. So we've got an upgrade for the shotgun, should definitely be doing some good damage now. And it looks 
looks like we've got the maximum amount we can be carrying. Okay. We're looking good. We're looking very good. The only issue now is that, of course, we've gone to every mine in the area. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Every mine in the area is now depleted. We'll have to go to a... Uh, what's it? We'll have to go through a cloud layer if we want to come across new resources. But... Uh, doing that... Would mean... Basically we'd have to face a boss wave. Well, not a boss. We'd have to face a large wave of enemies when we're about to face, you know, the boss wave, as in the boss wave at the top. <laughs> right, we'll get rid of these down here. Right, we're going to have to get some uh, repairs done. We can only get the one, but it's, it's going to have to be enough. Um, let's get some upgrades for the turret replicator. Ah, if we'd have been able to get that as well, but never mind. I think we are just gonna sit tight. We've got a minute to kill. So, we'll sit tight and we'll fight the boss in a minute. We've got to it, so hopefully that can help. Um, we've upgraded its fire rate, we've got some weapon upgrades, we've got all the basic ones, we should at least stand a chance, we've got some health, you know, the main issue is going to be dodging its attacks, simply put, that's going to be the main issue here, um, when we've done this, we'll have 2,354 meta currency points to spare, after we've bought the, uh, what's it, the capacity upgrade, so there's that, Oh god, I'm definitely, my nose getting blocked. Must be coming down with a bit of cold. Um, here we go. Yeah, I can't even get out of the way of that. Do I have to shoot the tentacles or do I have to shoot it? Don't know, but I can't move that way. There's a little thing in the way. Wouldn't even let me move down then for some reason. Shoot that exploding one. Ah, oh, crap, there's another exploding one. Too close. Yeah, we're dead. <laughs> Not a chance. <laughs> <laughs> right that'll be it for the episode thank you very much for watching we're going to purchase though that we've got even more capacity now the next one will be 12,000 and we're going to get the we're going to get the hook And we're going to save up for the turbines and the engine upgrade. Though we might be able next time to purchase these. So thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time.